to the city. Sorry about the mess. The observant amongst you may have noticed that the city is in something of a state of disrepair. This being because the city is currently under sea. The city lies at one end of a clear blue sea in a valley formed by a massive range of mountains. And is cut clean in two by the river. Now, we don't want to go into the messy details, but there's an army encamped across the river in the western half of the city. And what you're looking at here is the eastern half. This is what you'd call a civil war. So those are our neighbours and friends and colleagues across the river, shelling and shooting at us and trying to starve us to death. Bless. <laughs> but somehow, civil doesn't seem a very apt name for the current situation. So most people prefer to think of them as foreign invaders. <laughs> most people. Most people. I should also explain that the story we're about to tell has actually already taken place. So we should be telling it in flashback. <laughs> Seeing as you're here, we should just point out one or two architectural places of interest. Over this way is the tallest spire in the city. You can see it in between the tyre factory and the cinema. Or well, you could have done if you'd come here a couple of weeks ago. As the tallest spire in the city currently resides at ground level. Uh, you can probably just make it out on the tyre factory, next to where the cinema used to be. <gasps> you know when the Death Star blows up in Star Wars? Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's when the bomb hit the cinema. Death imitating art. <laughs> now over this way is the bicycle bridge. You'll be able to make that one out, as it's the only bridge still standing. 